Hi everybody, I'm Jim. And I'm Rich. And we're playing Resident Rise. Yep. Yeah. Today we get some power. Well, in a Well, bit. he's going to try. I, I expect he'll screw it up three or four times in the Shut process. <laughs> I'm going to work, oh, <laughs> work on my greenhouse here while I'm being oppressed by Jim. Not oppressed, just antagonized. <laughs> Alright, yeah. so I'm going to need some bottles so I can make some bottles of creosote oil. I was up way too late last night playing video games, and I'm tired. <laughs> Overwatch, I assume? No, no. More Minecraft stuff. I, I can't afford ah. Overwatch right now. Alright, so we've got some bottles of creosote. Uh, can mobs spawn on slabs? Uh, no, I don't think so. Okay. Why? Just curious. Okay. Why? Because I'm putting slabs as part of my greenhouse. I'm just like, spawning where would them. they be spawning? What's going on? Oh dear. Uh, so I'm gonna. I have a couple of water wheels, but I'm gonna make some more. And I'm gonna start digging up sand and placing stone slabs as my walkways throughout my greenhouses. I just need a crafting table, and why do I not remember where I left one? You mean you don't have three in your inventory? Not currently, but I will in a second. <laughs> what did you do? I already had one in my inventory. Yeah, of course. I told you you'd have one in your inventory. Shut up. <laughs> Water wheel. So we're going to need some treated wood planks. You need treated wood sticks, too. Yeah, but we need the planks first. I mean, not that I know anything about engineering stuff. Listen, man, we get it. You also play Minecraft. I should be able to just... I'm doing magic bullshit while living with an engineer and I know more about the engineering. Muffin. Should replace you with, with, with my better engineer. Your better engineer? Yeah, he's a ninja. Ah, I gotcha, I gotcha. Yeah. So we're gonna need some more sticks. I mean, no offense, you're a great engineer and everything, but... Yeah, ninja. yeah, thanks, thanks, man. No, not, certainly... Plus, he doesn't Not shoot me with a crossbow. It. One time. Uh, one? Yeah. No, no, it was multiple times with multiple boats. I Bolts. don't remember yeah. any of that. We have video evidence. It's out on the internet now. Uh, I don't, I don't think it is. I think that... I'm going to continue gaslighting you about this. Uh, until, uh... I don't know, forever? How's forever sound? We're going we're gonna to find out later that Jim has uh, taken the videos down where he shot me with this crossbow. No, are you kidding? That gets views, man. That shit's hilarious. Speaking of that, I mean, definitely 100% not speaking of that. Mm -hmm. do, do, do. Don't pay attention to anything I'm doing. Definitely don't worry about it. You're supposed to be getting power up and running, Jim. I'm definitely getting power up and running. I am not losing focus one bit as I look for flint and string for an unrelated reason. Mm -hmm. We had some flint for research purposes. Yeah, I'm not going to tell you where it is. You, but I... What? What's the problem? I don't understand what the problem is. Yeah, just I... you wait. Just you wait. I yes. will eventually make my own crossbow gym. Mm-hmm. By then, I'm, I'm hoping to be at Rail Rifle. Uh, we're going to need some sticks for this. Uh... Have I not told you about the, the crossbow that can almost one-shot the wither? Oh, yeah, that crossbow. Yeah. I'll do it, man. I'm familiar with that crossbow. I do not fear it. I'm trying to decide if my... S yeah, yeah, I hear you out there. Yeah, that's a cuff. Just stand on those punchy <laughs> sticks. Bah! Um, I'm trying to decide if I should double up these stone slabs, like, to make a full block, or just leave them half blocks. I don't know. Just doing a thing. Don't even worry about it. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, that's so much better. Jim, get back to making your water wheel. But, but, I'm just... Water I'm wheel? Just, Jim, focus? I was focus. so short on... We know you're short, but anyway. On air... Ouch! That's hurtful. Yeah. I think you're like a whole inch shorter than me. That's true, actually. I, re I, re I remember... I'm, I'm like the point. second shortest person on this channel. Kaylee being the shortest? Yes. I didn't know if I didn't know for sure Huck was taller than you. Huck is super taller than me. Huck is the tallest person on this channel. Oh, it's that time of morning. Uh, yeah. All right, so so let's do this for real. I'll stop just reloading my crossbow so I can harass Rich. We f I finished out the floor. We're going to redo the walls in a bit as soon as I get these chests cleared out. And we are going to um, in this area right now you're gonna build some water wheels and actually the thing I'm gonna need before I do that let's put a crafting table down here I'm sure there's one up there but let's not worry about that one let's put down a completely different one is a kinetic dynamo oh uh, yeah you're gonna want to place that before you place any of the wheels so we're gonna need copper wire coils which is sticks and copper ingots so we're gonna need some more sticks have you started making the water wheel framing? Oh, uh, not yet, no. Okay. I suspect I'll have to come supervise. Probably a little bit. Uh, you were the one that found this design. Um, do we know who originally designed it? I think it was hypnotized. Cool. And uh, he actually these... took the time to optimize the water wheel for as much power production as you could get by playing around with how the water flows. Mm -hmm. And I'm pretty sure this is his design. You should go check out his YouTube videos. Cool. We'll put that in the show notes, too. So now I have a kinetic dynamo, four water wheels. I can only actually hook up three of them. And I've got the design here, which is... Let's make some stone bricks. I'll leave that for now. Whoops. There we go. More sand. I don't know what we're going to do with all this sand. Alright. So. Looks like it's nine across. Nine. With walls on the side. And what we're going to do is we're going to basically set this up in a way that the water is constantly flowing over the wheel. Ow! I didn't do it. No, no, that wasn't your fault. That was me. Okay, good. Just making sure. And it looks like we're going to need... I'm just going to get this dynamo in place so I can see what this thing looks like. Okay. So we're gonna need to come up one more. Um, no, and you got over it wrong, a Jim. Bit. Probably. Take the wheel off. Yep. You, I was you, just, I'm just checking it out. Right okay, because you want the kinetic dynamo where that wheel was. And okay, you do have it right this side here of the kinetic dynamo. So we want to put the kinetic dynamo. How high up have you gone so far? Two. Or you mean my walls? Your walls just totally Oh, my high. walls are... Because uh, I think it should be three high. For the water wheel. Yeah, we can do that. I'm trying to remember, is it three up? Because... This all gets filled in at the bottom. Seems like we need to come out one more from the wall. Yeah, you gotta kind of center it. Cool. Do, 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 do. Kind of a where'd you go? There you are. 
Now, this is all new tech to me. I don't have a lot of experience with multi-block energy structures. They're cool, though. Would I turn the slack off? You don't. You never turn the slack off. Slack all day. Slack all night. That looks better. Can I spin it by running into it? No. No. Now, you've probably made the mistake most people do. You've got the kinetic dynamo backwards. Oh, yeah. 100%. It doesn't really have a side. Yeah, it does. Come over to where I am. Okay, it doesn't really have a side when you put it down. Something's still wrong looking at this picture, but you see that spot you're looking at right there? Yep. That's the side that has to connect to the kinetic uh, to the water wheels. So the best way to do it is take down your water wheel and stand on where the, the side the water wheel's on to place it. Okay. Bop. There we go. Uh, it's still looking off. Why does that still look off? I don't know. Maybe it's just because the rest of the structure is not built. Yeah, that's probably it. Careful examination. It's learning how to build energy structures. Alright. So you were going to work on greenhouses? Yeah. So let me mess around sure. with this for a while. I just wanted to make sure you got everything in place properly. Yep. Um, Just don't forget the on the picture where those uh, green wool blocks are. You need to put blocks there to get the flow going properly. Yeah. And let me know when you're ready to start putting in the water. We're going to use wood, and we're going to need some more glass, because I, I just realized that the water is going to flow out of this thing like crazy yeah. if I'm not careful. Plus, glass makes it look cooler when you're looking yeah. at it, if you put so the glass gonna, on the sides and stuff. I have some glass to make uh, conduit. Mm -hmm. But what we're gonna do is eat grab. What's that? Eat oh, carrots. he still eating carrots? Mm, I don't have food yet. We're gonna cook I up also, uh, some sand. Between the episodes, I made myself a sleeping bag. Ooh, nice. I got tired of running back into the actual beds. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da. I'm really excited about this. This lo this thing looks super cool. We can attach two more water wheels to this, mm -hmm. like that. And for now, we're only going to use the three, but later we're probably going to go up to more. in the box like it's my job. <laughs> so I'm trying to decide if I want to build the awesome tower of wizardry might, also known as like the the wizard's phallic symbol. Doesn't have to be a phallic symbol. Eh. It's gonna be a giant tower that's gonna eclipse your uh wait, why am I using spruce wood now? No, I don't want spruce wood. <laughs> um excuse me, ladies please. Keep your attacks to yourself. Alright. And so what we need here is two here. One here. Yep. One that's right above the water wheel. So we're just going to hop up. And we're going to need one that's 
at the same height, one out from the wall. So I'm going to come up over here, fill in these uh, holes. Uh, I miss being able to fly. Me too. Whoop. Again, I didn't do that. I definitely didn't just fall down. Mm hmm. Okay. So I'm going to need to cut these out, go up the other side. A bit more wood. So, note to self, staying up till like 3 in the morning to play Minecraft before doing a morning. Before work. playing more Minecraft in the morning? Yeah. Is a bad idea? Yeah. Welcome to the unfortunate side of adulthood, if you can call this adulthood. Well, at the same time, I'm also moving soon. Yeah. So, later today, I'm probably moving furniture. Well, not furniture. Um, furniture's waiting till I can get some more help. You know, younger, stronger help. You're younger, right? I am younger than you, that's true. Uh, thankfully, we don't have a lot of big furniture to move. That's alright, you're going far anyway. We're just moving two, of, two floors, I think? No, one floor, but it's the other end of the building. Ah. Sweet. Of course I did. I left one block unfilled. Alright. You're putting the water in? Or Not yet. You... Okay. Not yet. We're well, you said unfilled, so I was... Oh, wondering. sorry, it was a stone block. Uh, and of course, my pickiness makes me take down part of my greenhouse. <laughs> I am missing one structure. It needs to be against the wall, and it needs to be one block lower. Right? So if I come around to this side to look at my guide. Yeah. Got that one. Four blocks in between those, and then it's going to flow downward. Yeah, the real trick is making sure you get the water flowing in the right directions. Oh, yeah. Water, Minecraft water physics are entertaining. Yep. Things I've learned. How to play around with red wo red wood, bleh, red wire uh, alloys and um, making up uh, timers and sequencers and stuff. Huh, neat. Something I'll get shown later when I go to start bullying uh, nodes to make a bigger one. Ooh. That sounds intriguing. Yeah. I don't know anything about magic. It's okay, you don't know much about engineering either. Ouch! Shots fired! Yep. Alright. So let's head back upstairs, check on the glass. I'm tired, it's bitchy water. Richard Day. <laughs> and we'll get some water so that we can build a well and then start filling this in. And soon we'll have power. All the power all the time. Um, probably. Well, you get all the power some of the time or some of the power all the time. What if we want all the power all the time? You don't get all the power all the time. Okay. Did you decide on what cables you were using? I'm going to use the leadstone. Did you decide on what you're using for power storage? Uh, nothing yet. But I'll probably make a leadstone battery. I should be able to make a leadstone battery pretty easily. Okay. 
I still recommend Ender IOs. Yeah, to their but we just one. don't have the the machines for them yet. Don't we? Mm, no, they take an alloy smelter, don't they? Maybe. Uh, what's the basic capacitor tank? Bank. Need. Um. Wait, I can make capacitor seeds? I don't know what that what? is. What? Combine two soul sand with some and some dirt on the bottom, a basic capacitor in the middle, uh, some white dyes and stuff on the side, and three pamps harvest craft seeds on the tops. You can make capacitor seeds that allow you to grow Ender IO capacitors. Oh, they need power to grow, so you have to have them planted on a uh, specifically, but. Okay. That's still kind of cool. So, the first thing we're going to do is dig a well. Um, but anyway, basic capacitors need. I love the sound that these machine blocks make. So, the basic capacitors just need a. Uh, Four gold nuggets, a copper ingot, and two redstone. Uh, you need four of those, um, four iron ingots, and a redstone, um, a block of redstone, to make the um, basic capacitor bank, which will hold one million uh, RF. Okay. Well, then we'll build one of those. Yeah. Not that um, I know anything about uh, engineering stuff. Well, you spent more time with Ender IO than I have. Because it's um, actually pretty cool. Yeah, I don't know much about it. All my engineering knowledge is old school. Yeah, this is why I'm trying to get you to use new stuff. <laughs> Push my limits. Yeah. Somebody's got to. Alright, it's water time. Bam, 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 bam. Alright, so... I shall come back and watch you screw this up. Oh yeah, this is, this is going to be the hard part. First, see if you actually got the structure built properly. Oh man, um, the other Minecraft stuff I'm playing with my brother, he's doing engineering and I'm doing magic. Wow, you flooded the place. Oh yeah, that was, that was going to happen. This would be a lot easier with a jetpack. I mean, lots of things would, but... This would be a lot easier if you hadn't flooded everything too. Listen, man, setting up the water. The water's got to flow properly or it doesn't work. Yeah, I know. Getting that impression. Alright, so let's pull that out. Wow, is that dark without torches? Yeah, it gets dark down in the basement, man. So the real question is, looking at the picture, do you know which way the water flows on each of the spots? Uh, no. Okay, so at the top, obviously it flows, looking at the direction I am, it flows from this block over here, Yep. this way, down, and around. Now, at the bottom, when you get the water flowing, uh, and that's where it gets tricky. At the back spot, at the water, the mm -hmm. bottom water needs to keep flowing in this uh, same direction the wheel's moving. And your wheel is going the wrong way, Jim. My wheel is going the wrong way. What did you do? But it's going! Yes, but, but what did you do to get it to turn the wrong way, Jim? Mm hmm. Magic? No, no, you don't do magic. Well, <laughs> apparently I do. No, I know why. It should not it's because be... it's flowing. It's because it's flowing down this way. It sh shouldn't. That's the thing. Uh, so let's start with this one. Now that could be because you don't have the everything blocked properly up top. 
that it's flowing down the back. Yeah. Because it shouldn't be able to flow that way if you've got it set up right. No, those blocks actually don't help any, Jim. Mm, we'll see. Okay. You keep working at it, and then I'll come critique it. <laughs> We're generating that? RF, man. Yes, but we want to maximize our RF generation. All right. <sighs> man, after I get this greenhouse blocked out, I'm going to have to get my peoples working. Your peoples? My peoples. From ancient oh warfare. yeah, right. Your your villagers. Yes, my village peoples. Seems legit. Oh yeah, I need more wood. All right. So let's pop out some of this wood. Because, yeah, the tricky part is doing this without completely flooding the basement. What if you build up this, the glass walls first? Well, that's what I'm doing right now. This entire episode, Jim relearns how water physics work. Yeah, how Minecraft water physics work? Minecraft water physics are weird. Been a, I will admit, it's been a while. See, this is what happens when you get an actual life, Jim. You forget the important things. Like how Minecraft water physics work? Yes. Fair? How Minecraft works in general. Okay, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Where are we getting? Well, we're still flowing backwards. Um, oh, no, we're not. No, we're not. We're going the right way. We're going the right way. Need some more pains. We can do this. Some max pains? No, some uh, middling pains, actually. Alright. Time to check the progress again. On what? On your, uh... It's cool, man. I'm a grown-ass man. I can do this. Uh-huh. you put wait what why do you have water flowing at the bottom Jim because there's water flowing at the bottom of the picture you don't actually need to put the water down at the bottom front yourself it'll do it up top it'll just come right down the front you also need more water at the back you only have well, one line we're, we're just one at a time man one at a time relax deep breaths deep breaths <sighs> All right. I haven't had my tea yet today. Well, we'll let Rico get some tea, and uh, we'll come back next episode. Uh, tea...